stop it right there. What? What are you doing with that hydrogen peroxide? I'm going to add hydrogen peroxide to my garden. There has to be a reason to use hydrogen peroxide. There's no set schedule on how often you should add hydrogen peroxide to your garden. You should only add hydrogen peroxide to your garden when there is a need. I made a video previously about five benefits of using hydrogen peroxide in your garden and also hyper boosting plant growth using hydrogen peroxide. However, in both videos, I mentioned that I had a problem. My plants were turning brown and dying. And that was mainly because of the unfinished compost that I added to my garden. Unfinished compost creates an anaerobic process in the soil, which locks up nutrients in the soil and also deprives plant roots of oxygen. So hydrogen peroxide is very beneficial in this instant. Adding hydrogen peroxide to your soil will actually help to decompose the organic matter much quicker and also provide a lot of oxygen to the roots of the plants. Adding hydrogen peroxide to your garden will kill off anaerobic bacteria, which is the bad bacteria, and also aerobic big bacteria which is the good bacteria it will kill off bad and good microorganisms however in our garden we need a healthy balance of microbes plants thrive on the microorganism activity in the soil over time when hydrogen peroxide decomposes the byproducts are water and oxygen so it's not necessarily bad for your environment and it's not necessarily bad for your plants however it is bad for your soil plants depend on very healthy soil with good microorganism balance in the soil so only add hydrogen peroxide in the soil when there is actually a need if you have a pest problem or if you have a stunted growth in your plants or if you have unfinished compost in your garden those are the only reasons you would actually add hydrogen peroxide to your garden look at your plants listen to your plants if they are healthy if they're happy leave them alone if you have a healthy soil don't add hydrogen peroxide to your plants like they say if ain't broken don't fix it Treat hydrogen peroxide like medicine for your plants. Only add hydrogen peroxide to your garden if there is absolutely a need for it. If your plants are stunted for growth because there isn't enough oxygen in the soil available to the roots of your plants, if you have a really bad pest problem in the soil, you can add hydrogen peroxide to your soil. It will kill off all microbes, good and bad. However, while hydrogen peroxide decomposes, it produces water and oxygen and all the good bacteria will return to the soil and the bad bacteria will still be eliminated. So it will still create a healthy balance in the soil over time. There are a lot of misconceptions surrounding hydrogen peroxide. Some people think it's a really harmful chemical. It is used in hospitals to treat wounds. It is used to sanitize equipment. It is used in hydroponics to sanitize equipment and also sanitize growing medium as well. Hydrogen peroxide is approved by EPA to be used outdoors and the only byproducts are water and oxygen. However, discretion is always advised. Anything in large quantities could be bad and you should only use it if you need it. You can always use hydrogen peroxide to disinfect your growing medium, your growing containers for seedlings and also your seeds as often as you like. I really hope this cleared up some of the misconceptions about hydrogen peroxide and also provided enough information to safely use hydrogen peroxide if you have a need to. If you like the video, hit the subscribe button and I'll see you in another video.